Welcome to Snail Trail 4x4. Today we are pulling the transmissions out of the first gen and out of Bobcat, and we're going to do some more of this swappy swap stuff. got both of the transmissions out now we're just evaluating what's the difference between them and if any modifications need to be made to one or the other one of the things that we um, that I had on my transmission setup is my Marlin crawler reduction um, adapter was clocked 10 degrees so um, we're trying to look into that and see if we can just swap some things of parts across and um, see if we can make that work just that easy um, by pulling one of the um, snap rings and swap in a few gears and hopefully fingers crossed that will work but it wasn't that bad to get them out it did take some prying out of the first gen here bobcat slid right out because he's excited to be getting an r151 Oh, shit. 
here is the flywheel and you can see that there's some discoloration uh, browning and things of that nature and then just some like spots that don't look the same as the rest of it so uh, that's what's concerning me I really don't know too much about flywheel so if anybody's out there that has a, a comment on this please let me know um, is that okay is that bad I'm can highly considering getting another one what are your thoughts uh, please let me know in the comments below transmissions are out we're gonna start putting them in um, once the RTV dries but that'll probably be tomorrow or the next day whenever we get back to it so hammer down on that subscribe button and don't forget keep crawling